everyone, it is me, William Proventude, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Alright guys, so like I told you, we're gonna be going for something a little bit more dramatic, way more dramatic than last time. I'm just really feeling this sunset realness, ombre lip realness, um, big lashes. I have not worn lashes like this in a minute, but honestly, I don't feel them, so I'm winning. If this is your first time here, please hit that subscribe button. If this is not your first time here, then you know what to do. Hit that like button and make sure that notification bell is on so you get notifications as to when I will be uploading a video. Other than that, guys, follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok. I don't know if I have a TikTok yet, but I want to make a TikTok because that's where everybody is. And TikTok is about to get banned, y'all. Did you see that? Did you see Anyway, please enjoy the video. Again, hit that like button and that subscribe button. Share, please share this video. I am a starting YouTuber. I am a starting YouTuber, so it would be great if you could share this video. All right, love you guys, and I'll see you at the end of the video. All right, guys. So first, I'm gonna go in with my summer fave, the Bye Bye Foundation with the SPF 50 in it. By a cost. I just do one pump of medium and like two pumps of light, and then I'm good to go. Alright guys, so next we're going to be going in with some eye brightener. This is Becca's light to medium under eye brightening corrector. That's all you need. A little bit goes a long way and then I'm going to take my finger and blend it out. Sometimes I'll go in with a brush. I'll use a brush if I want more of an airbrush finish. Next I'm going to be taking the palette in my hands, the RCMA palette. And I'm going to take this warm shade right here. Excuse the mess. I love this. I just love, like, I just love face, the contour and everything. So I use this palette like no other. <laughs> Now I'm going to take a stippling brush and lightly blend this cream contour out. So I definitely accidentally went a little heavy with the cream contour, but we can fix it. It'll be alright. Now we just look very warm and sun kissed, so. Okay, on camera I look a little crazy, but in person I look warm. Okay, so now that I'm happy with the base, I'm going to take the Laura Mercier powder. I didn't take it out, I have to go get it. Alright, so now I'm going to take an angled brush and that same NYX contour palette, and I'm just going to take the lightest shade right here, and place that wherever I place the green powder. Alright friends, now I'm going to take a MAC blush in Gingerly, and I am going to place that on Alright guys, so, ooh, I feel like you're like really close. I hope you can't see anything gross in my teeth. If you can, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alright, anyway guys, I'm going to be going in to the... Oh, I'm going to try to do like a cool thing. Ready? Well, that's cute. The Alyssa Edwards palette. I'm going to be taking this guy and I'm going to be using the shade Brick. Oh my gosh. How do I do this? I'm sorry, guys. I'm taking the shade Brick Road. I'm going to scrape it a little bit just because I want it to be like really bright. So I'm just going to scrape the tiny that you can see I scraped it. And then take my brush. It's a little damp. I damped it with um, just some setting spray. And then I'm going to place it Cool! Yes! Yeah, see, that's what I wanted. I wanted it to be pigmented. So, with brighter shades, you want to pat them in if you want them to be bright. Oh 
going to be taking it and tapping it on the same exact brush we were just using and placing it where to get it all in. Yes. Period. And again, when you want shades to be bright, you tap them. So now that I'm happy with how much color is on the eye, I am going to take my brush, tap it, maybe even swirl it on like a tissue just to get some color off, and then take my brush, my fingers are all the way at the end of the brush. And then I'm going to take it and lightly blend the edges. Now, just so that I can kind of fan out the edge, I'm going to take a fluffier brush. It looks dirty, but there's actually nothing on it. And I'm going to just blend out these edges. Again, keeping my fingers at the edge of the brush and just blending the shadow. Alright, so I'm personally happy with this blend, so I'm just going to do the other eye and I'll be right back. Alright friends, so now I'm going to be dipping back into the Alyssa Edwards palette and we're going to be taking the shade Dream It. Dream It. And we're going to do a bold, a bold blue eyeliner. Just a bold, a boom. Like, I want the, like, the, like, I want the most contrasted color and I want that on my under eyelid. And that's on period. And that's just what I want. Alright, so now I'm going to be taking another eyeshadow from the person that shall not be named, but the formula is great and we'll just keep using it because we're too broke to buy new eyeshadows. Um, <laughs> I'm going to be taking this light white shiny shade and just placing it on the inner corner. So if you guys are wondering like the tricks to lashes, my best advice is putting your glue down on a surface, like putting a dot on, and then... Um, is there a white hair in my lash? Oh, it was the dog hair. There was a dog hair in my lash. <laughs> put the lash glick on the surface so that it starts to get tacky on its own. Then place... Oh, first measure the lash. Take the lash, put it on your eye. If anything goes beyond your lash, cut that off. After that, you're going to take your lash glue, put a ball on the surface, and then take the glue and then literally just like glide the lash in there. And then I would wait like a minute before you put them on. We have our lashes on. We're going to go back into complexion. I'm going to be taking a wet and wild highlighter. This is Golden Power Crown. And I'm going to be placing that on my cheekbones. All right, friends. So next up is lip liner. And this is Sore by MAC. Was my lip crooked? I think my lip's a little crooked. It's okay. Alright, so lastly, I'm going to be taking this dip. I don't know who this is. I got this in like a kit a while back, but I love the texture of these lipsticks. They're so creamy and I just love a good thick lipstick. So, we're going to take in this bright pink shade here. Mm -hmm. We wear a wig. Do we wear a wig? Do we bring back 2010 William? Do we wear the 100% human hair wig? Do we? Do we? Mm. Bitch. Oh, I'm cussing because I'm just so excited. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you so much for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed it. It was so much fun making it. I missed getting into makeup and hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you so much. I'll see you next week. Bye guys.